Your alarm is disturbing my process. Sorry. Why do you need to take another nap? You wake up lupus. Well, what am I supposed to do? You're in here doing whatever it is that you're doing. I'm making a card for the president. Just for fun? This, this is very clearly a card with a rainbow on it. Oh, of course it is. Why would Ben being colorblind concern you so much? If he can't see color, then my work is meaningless. That's something you're like supposed to tell people. Like, I have herpes. I am colorblind. I've been concerned about this for a long time. I've been like, I've been having a lot of dreams about it. Um, what kind of dreams? In the dream, it's supposed to be like a really unimportant conversation. And then in the middle of it, he's like, oh, and yeah, just, you know, by the way, you know I'm colorblind, right? And then I have a panic attack. And then I look like the crazy one because I'm the one having a panic attack and he's acting normal. Everyone always sides with the person who's acting normal. My grandmother used to have this room in her house that was just, that had that black and white checked floor. And my mom used to bring me in there and I just used to cry. It's never the first assumption that the person who's having the panic attack is in the right. Because maybe there's something worth panicking about. Has he told you that he's not colorblind? No, that's one thing. He's never explicitly said, no, I am not colorblind. Maybe he's not colorblind. Okay, maybe that's not a very useful way to... Uh... Maybe he's not a natural blonde. Okay. Maybe. Well, we're having dinner tomorrow for our six-month anniversary, and I'm just saying I'm going to be on high alert for any sorts of, you know anti-color behavior. I think that for this week, the craft that you make should address your fears about this relationship. And make sure to itemize each fear very clearly in your video diary. Okay, so I'm making this doll quilt, and I'm using this tragic black and white contact paper to express my concerns that Ben is colorblind, and I'm using this paper towel to express my fear that when it ends, it's just gonna be this enormous mess, and I'm using this hammock netting to express my concerns about often he takes naps. Hey, I can't really talk right now, what's up? Union Square is not that confusing, Ben. It's like a kindergarten level system. It's numbers and colors. I am injured, I have to go. Okay, we're breathing, breathing. Hi, good evening. Can I start you folks off with some wine? Uh, yes. I think we've settled on a bottle of this. Awesome. We'll be right back with that. I am going to go wash my hands. Here we go. Ma'am, all of this will be fully restored. Don't worry. Oh, well, the wine came. Other than that, I don't think you missed anything since you left. Um... Did we get the specials? No. Oh, we do have some specials tonight if you're interested. I meant to ask you about that. You used to have this duck. Oh, it was so good. Last time I was here, I had it. It was amazing. We switched to our summer menu? My things have changed. Just so many changes. I just, I wonder if we could name them all. But we do have a pork roast if you're interested. Excuse me, I'm sorry, I um I need to go to the bathroom. So are you interested in the specials? Or are you still thinking about all of the things that are now different? I'll have the pork roast. Well, I have a question for her. Um, it's a sort of a pork roast au jus. Excuse me, sorry, just this is very important. This vegetable pasta. Is it, it's, the pasta's made with vegetables or there's just vegetables in it? The pasta is made with vegetables. So it's many different colors? Is it many different colors? Yes. Then that's what I'll have, please, thank you. Well, I'll be having the pasta. Will you please sit down? Do you like my dress? You haven't mentioned it. Of course I do. Oh, you do? Have you examined it to the absolute best of your ability? What is going on? Sit me. Are you out of your goddamn mind? Do you have to do whatever it is that you're doing in the middle of this restaurant? I need you to unzip me and I promise I won't be naked. Oh, happy anniversary to me. Hello. Hello. Do you see me? 
me. Am I missing something here? I don't know. Potentially the magic of the whole thing. Okay, I've got a vegetable pasta. Look at this pasta and tell me what you see. Okay, you need to lower your voice. Look at this pasta and tell me what you see. Okay, you're obviously going through something right now, but I'm not going to have this conversation with you until you lower your voice. You cannot even describe this pasta, you lying son of a bitch. What the f*** is the matter with you? Ma'am, I'm gonna have to ask you to- All of this will be restored! All right. You would- That's it. Oh, you're damn right that's it. I'm not staying in this grayscale prison of a relationship for another second with you. The feeling's mutual, sweetheart, but with you, it's more like a seizure-inducing neon laser light show! Oh, as if you know the difference! So I think you said that you were going to be making a, something called a doll's quilt. Yeah, a doll quilt would be smaller. It would be a quilt for a doll. And the paper towels were supposed to represent the mess. I just made a big mess, so I made a big quilt. Okay. How did you leave things? I glitter bombed him and ran out of the restaurant. Taxi! Did you resolve the color blindness question, at least? Not really. I do have some concerns that he may have lupus, but I think I made a big mess in that restaurant. Hmm. With the glitter. And, like, my feelings. Mm hmm But, on a certain level, I guess that's the same thing. Maybe, maybe the world ends tomorrow. Maybe today is our last if today is uh, this live life maybe today is our last day with color what a sad day it is today for him what <laughs> <laughs> We don't know that. <laughs> <laughs>